gonna shoot the 3006, y'all. That's the uh, Browning VAR. Shoot it at uh, Squeeze the trigger one time. Get the, I haven't shot this in a while. All right, pretty smooth trigger. All right, fire in the hole. Shoot at the fucking seventy-five. <sighs> the gun didn't cycle. This ammo isn't the isn't the greatest. This gun is finicky with the with the uh, with the loads. Let me turn it up. To, uh, turn it up. Seven power. Let's see how that goes. to the right. Not that far though. Off. I'm gonna come right two inches and down two inches. All right, let's shoot another. Let's make sure this thing's cycled. Yeah, looks like it did. I do want to take that brass home. Good luck finding it. Didn't cycle. It's the ammo. This ammo, like I said, is not the greatest.
right, but it went up. That's much better. Came down slightly to the left. Alright, let me bring in one inch to the right and we should be good. Oh, see this? Let me bring it one inch to the right. shooting a little high though. Shoot one more. That was probably me. Yeah, that's right on the money. I think I'm good. Yeah, I'm not going to touch it. That's good. <clears throat> I'm going to ceasefire. I'm going to take, I'm going to put a target out at 100. Let me pick up my brass. Right, here's the, uh, this is the 50 yard target that the wind took away. gauge rifle slug barrel I think it's me I think I really think it's me definitely an improvement with the scope with the Bushnell scope but it's definitely me is it 306 Again, I'm uh, I'm getting myself ready for hog hunting in Florida, so maybe I'll just bring the 306. Although carrying that gun all day, it's heavy and cumbersome. It's not the greatest gun to carry all day. All right, let's see how we did at, uh, 75. Thank you. 
And again, this is the 3006. We adjusted it a little bit. This was my last round right here. The one that I'm walking right now. This one right here with the floor. So that's, I think I'm good. I mean, it's definitely a dead hog. Let me move this thing back to 100. Without getting tetanus, if possible. When you go to the range, always bring a hammer. I'm gonna put a couple more targets up on this. What I'm gonna do is probably do a trigger job on that Thompson Encore. I have another Thompson that shoots one inch groups at a hundred, my muzzle loader. I did a trigger job on that. And I think the second muzzle loader, the second uh, Thompson also needs a trigger job. Alright, I'll shoot at those, we'll see what happens. Let's shoot at, uh, let's shoot at 100 with the 30 L. the magnification to nine. This is a three by nine by 40 scope Bushnell, old. This thing is probably 30, 40 years old, maybe more.
don't see any holes. That's not a good sign. And that doesn't mean that they're not there. I just can't see them at this at this range. All right, three rounds. Let me grab my brass. Two, three, and see any holes I don't see any holes well, let me walk down there and see I'm heading down again.
Okay. Let's get some other wood. Let's support this in the back and the front. Let's go see what we did. If anything. Oh, I see some holes. Yeah, they're high. That's a pretty good group. I don't have the most stable situation where I'm at. But this is the group up here. One, two, three. All right, so it looks like I gotta come down. One, two, three, four, five. Got to come down about five inches, down five to the left three. All right, I'll try that. All right, let's go check these targets. So, actually not bad. After I made the scope adjustment, I came from here to here. This is at 100. Again, my rest is really not the greatest. And then I took another three. I know this was me here. I was off. I, I didn't, these shots didn't feel all that great. Um, but yeah, so what I'll do is I'll come, I'll come to the right. I'll come to the right another... Uh, I'll come to the right another couple of inches and put a few more rounds down range. Alright, I just adjusted to the right a few is inches. You know this is anybody's? That's mine. You could use it if you want though. You could use it. Are you sure? Yeah, you could use it. Yep. No problem. You could use it. Appreciate it. Yeah, no, of course. Before I do that, let me try something different here. Let me try something a little different. Oh. 
All right, I'm gonna try to shoot with, uh, with just this front sandbag. I'm gonna shoot for the right target. It helps if you put a round in the chamber. That one felt pretty good. Let's go again. surprise me that's good Yeah, I'm happy with that. <clears throat> happy with it? Oh yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh yeah.